Most people in America are familiar with their own personal responsibilities. Most people in America are familiar with their own professional accountabilities. They know what is and isn't their job sometimes if they were properly trained. Most people in America must have a job description so they know the detailed account of what their corporations and their companies expect them to be about while they're on the job and in their communities when they step off the job in their uniforms representing the brand. If you're not talking about that in your trainings, then you've failed your company because it doesn't allow that individual to associate himself with the current position he's in or the future position he may hold. I am regularly talking to people that come a little bit out of poverty because they don't have a lot of post-secondary education and they don't think about extra certification. And what you hear from them most, as opposed to I love my job, is how much they hate their job or how much they can't stand their boss or how much they're overworked and underpaid. Now that is a problem in America, but that's why people build their own business. That's why people manage their own time. That's why people are concerned when people abuse other people. Abuse of Americans is something we have to be careful of. A lot of people don't always remember the hostage situation in the 80s that when we were in elementary school we had to follow and it was sort of scary to people who were young. But it's something we had to clip newspapers, uh, clippings on in one of my classes and it was sort of, sort of an over abuse of a child's mind. But in life we have to understand what America is about. America is about life, liberty, and the pursuit of happiness and I may say this in every video at nauseum to the people who are really following, really listening all the time. But at the same time, it's possible nobody's listening, but at the same time, we might. what we really know about social media is that we don't always get the exact data of how many people are listening. That a company can offer you viewing, but they may not offer how many people are viewing because you're not paying additional. You're not paying for the higher option. Here's the problem. That technology costs, but it also costs America time. It also costs America employees and it also costs America a lot of their rights. We have to get back to privacy rights, it's true. We have to revise and review again medical rights in terms of continuity of care and how technology is being used to abuse our privacy rights. We also have to review our military because the military needing to be across America is absolutely true. We used to have bases in almost every city or around every major metropolis and we need to go back to that, it's true. We need to stop buying up land to make housing units, which we don't need more of, that people can't afford. And we need to go back to the basics of building communities where the business is downstairs and the family lives either behind it in the same buildings or above it.